Hey guys, it's Ron Williams. Welcome back to the Ron Williams YouTube channel. Uh, I'm headed out to one of my favorite restaurants and I'm gonna show you how to eat in a way that's very conducive for any nutritional program. Many times people get discouraged because they don't think they can eat out and have a nutritional meal that's conducive uh, for their uh, for the diet and nutrition plan I'm gonna show you exactly how to do that as we go to Olive Garden so let's go do it see you again how are you doing good you Emma how are you I'm well this is it this is actually one of my favorite restaurants to eat Olive Garden let's go thanks you know, actually, there's a, a lot of things, a great assortment of foods that you can eat on this menu, and some of them are absolutely the richest things you've ever put in your mouth. And they also have the desserts and all of that kind of thing, but that, basically, stay away from. And I go over here and I look at what's going to be conducive for my diet plan. So, as I look through here, today I'm probably going to have fish and uh, vegetables for certain. But it's not the fish that's so important. What's really, really important is how I order it. Now, when I order it, I'm going to give them very specific directions. Because one thing a cook does is his desire is to make sure that the food tastes good. So even when you say, I don't want this, I don't want that, sometimes it'll slip a little bit in just so it gives it a good flavor. That's what a chef does. So I have to make it very, very clear that my server translates it well to the cook so when it comes out, I don't send it back. I let them know if it's not the way I want it, I have to send it back. And it's not that I'm trying to be uh, snobbish or anything like that but certain things I just can't allow into my body. And if they don't do it the way I want, I can't eat at that restaurant because I have goals and I have um, short-term as well as long-range goals. And if that place that I'm eating in is counterproductive to my goals, by all means, I just can't eat that. So I want you to watch when she comes over what I order. Well, first of all, I would like uh, a water. The water in the, in the bottle, what is that called? The aquapana. Aquapana. Do you want a tall or a small? Uh, I like the small aquaponic. Yeah. Do you want any lemon or anything with that? Or a chill Lemon black? is good. Lemon would be good. Yeah. So, aquapana, that would be good. There you go, guys. Brit. Yeah. Now, when I order, this is going to be um, kind of strange because I order a little bit different. But the important thing is um, I realize that the chef, his job is trying to make the food taste good. But my goal is to, to have it really dry because sometimes if you put like butter on my food, I'll actually regurgitate it. And so if there's any butter or oil and stuff like that, that's why. No oil or butter? So no oil, no butter. And I would like to have um, salmon that's blackened with no oil, no butter. And then I would like the salad with no croutons, no pepperoncinis, and no olives, and just the uh, dressing on the side. So you just want the lettuce and tomatoes? Lettuce, tomatoes, and... Do you want onions? Onions, lots of onions. Lots of onions. So plain salad with onions and tomatoes. Right. And dressing on the side? Dressing on the side. Do you want the regular dressing or the low fat dressing? Mm, just the regular dressing. Okay. But with the uh, the grilled fish, that's the, that's what's the most important. Okay. Grilled fish with no oil, just black. Gotcha. I will okay. let them know. Anything else? Um, just um, a bit of pasta with the red sauce. What kind of pasta would you eat? So we have spaghetti, we have penne, we have vegetable penne, we have cavatappi, we have angel hair. Um, just spaghetti. Just spaghetti? Mm -hmm. So spaghetti with the tomato sauce or marinara sauce? Marinara. Okay. 
Okay. Sounds like what? Okay, now, the first thing, the water is so important. Our bodies are actually made up of 65 to 70% water. So water really does affect who you are, okay. your life, uh, also the quality of life. So what I do is I take the mineral drops and make sure I get a good pure source of water and I put the mineral drops in it to make sure that, um, see the minerals help to purify and cleanse the body. Also the body is electrically conducted. So it's very important to get the minerals in. We've got um, a video that you can look at and it talks about the minerals. So go to that video and find out a little bit more about it. But I make sure I never just drink tap water because there's so many different chemicals, um, fat, loss resistant chemicals that's in the water, like your chlorine, your fluorine, your uh, bromine. Um, there, there's so many different types of toxins. All of your, your halogens uh, create an environment for your body to collect extra body fat, extra body fat, and actually retards uh, your metabolism. So we try to stay away from that and we put as much iodine as we possibly can in our foods and eat foods with you know, lots of iodine. So the minerals are really important. So that's one thing that you want to be um, concerned about or cognitive about, that you need those minerals in the water. Don't just drink anything. Just because the water is clear doesn't mean that it's clean. That is absolutely awesome. Isn't that beautiful? I need it. Did you really? I did. Thank you. Do you want breadsticks? No breadsticks. I thought I'd ask. Do you want cheese? No cheese. And then here's how it's going to go. Okay, okay. Thanks. Enjoy them. As you can see here, we have a salad that has the romaine lettuce, it has the onions, and also uh, the tomatoes. I mean, this is an awesome salad, as you can see. Now, I eat as much of this as I want to because some of the calories, I mean, it's very, very low in calories, but a great meal. So my carbohydrates are really coming from the pasta. But this right here is a great salad because it has the sulfuric vegetables, which, which would be the onions, and also with the romaine lettuce. What happens is it actually pulls the fat loss resistant chemicals out of the body. So that is awesome. And when I say fat loss resistant, what I mean by that is we have chemicals that are stored in the fat cells. If you live in America, you can't help but to get those chemicals in your body. I mean, whether it's through drinking, uh, regular water, whether it's through eating foods that have been sprayed with pesticides, insecticides, herbicides, uh, whatever means that might be, you have those fat loss resistant chemicals in your body. So we want to get rid of them. Onions, one of the best things you can take in to help destroy and eliminate some of those toxins from the system. So that's one of the reasons why I love the onions and also um, the romaine lettuce rather than just the iceberg lettuce. So we're going to enjoy this salad. Some of you might think, man, that's a salad. You know what? You are right. I love, love, love salad. The other thing is they have a, an Italian dressing. And I don't eat a lot of the Italian dressing, so I always get it on the side. And they just, you know, they spread it all over the salad. But I just take a little dab here and there just to give it a little flavor. That might be possibly two tablespoons. And I also bring a little container of oil that I put on my food also. The oil would be the essential fatty acid that I, that I use. Awesome. Oh. That is Friend. beautiful. Do you want any more salad? Could we have another one, please? Yeah, I'll leave it. I'll get another one for you. Thank you so much. Anything else other than this? No, this is it. <laughs> you've got to admit, this is one of the best meals you've ever looked at. Look at it. We've got, uh, we've had our salad. Now we have our fish. 
which has been blackened somewhat. It's got the marinara sauce with the pasta, which is where we're gonna get our uh, carbohydrates from. I wanna get the majority of my carbohydrates, the complex carbohydrates, early on in the day, rather than waiting till later. So now I have my complex carbohydrates right here. And what a great source of protein and essential fatty acids. So yeah, this is a great meal. I just had a great meal taking a salad home and they gave me five pieces of chocolate. You have no idea what this does for the kids. So take these home, give it to my kids, had a great meal, didn't get any better than that. Just, just remember, you can eat out. You just have to be real careful how you order, what you order, and you know, take your favorite person and have a good time. If you like this video, or should I say, if you love this video, make sure you subscribe and get your friends to subscribe because this is your station. God bless you.